Joe Resnell with the front line with Joe and Joe. Once again, let us go into the breach. Justin Trudeau told the New York Times that Canada is becoming a new kind of country, not defined by our history or European national origins, but by a pan-cultural heritage. He goes on, there is no core identity, no mainstream in Canada, including that he sees Canada as the first post-national state. Even the New York Times called the suggestion radical. It is radical, completely and utterly radical. A, such a statement. You see, men like Trudeau and Barack Obama, this is what's coming out of the universities, the big universities. I believe uh, Trudeau went to McGill. Obama went to Columbia and Harvard. This is what they're teaching these people. I don't know why our parents still send our kids to these schools. This is what you get when you send your kid to one of those schools. People are so like basically hypnotized by the prestige. Oh, my kid's going to Columbia. Yeah, he comes out and he basically is ashamed of his country. And then because he's intelligent or she's intelligent, they have the tools to twist the country. This is what you get. But why did a generation like Trudeau, like Obama, come to this point? They're not rooted in anything. They're not rooted in anything, particularly religion and God. You see, a person that's rooted in God firmly, whether they're an Orthodox Jew or say they're a conservative Christian and they go to college, to be honest with you, you're not phased by stuff like this in many respects. Also, if you have a solid family, the family structure is, 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 is fragmented in both Canada and America. And frankly, people are like a boat on an ocean. They're just drifting. And then they get caught up in these type of ideologies. And because they're gifted, they're smart people, then they get out into the world and they wreak havoc. And Barack Obama and Justin Trudeau have done just that, the damage that they've done. They've influenced countless people. Frankly, again, people who are just like boats on the ocean, drifting. They're not grounded in anything substantial. This is why the battle for Canada and America is spiritual. It's a spiritual battle. People have to get back to first principles, God and family. When you have God and family, you don't fall for people like Justin Trudeau. And you don't make statements like he made, basically saying that ca Canada doesn't have a national identity. Of course, it has a national identity. It's Canada. And he should be. To be honest with you, he's the president of the country. He should love his country. Doesn't seem like he does to me.